The next item on the Seder plate that we're going to be looking into is Kharosat. Kharosat is one of the symbolic foods that we have at our Seder and is a sweet paste typically made up of fruits, nuts and wine. It takes its place on the lower right side of our Seder plate. So where does Kharosat come from? Like why on earth is it on our Seder plate? They say that Kharosat represents the cement that the Jews used to make bricks whilst they were slaves in Egypt. This idea originates in Shemot, which says that the Egyptians enslaved the children of Israel with backbreaking labour and they embittered their lives with hard labour, with clay and with bricks and with all kinds of labour in the field. There's also another link. If you look at the Hebrew word of Kharoset, the root of it, the Chet, Reis and the Samach, means clay. Our sages give us another reason for Kharoset. And this is, is that Kharoset is meant to remind the Jewish people of the apple trees in Egypt. Why the apple trees? So this is because supposedly the Jewish women would quietly and painlessly give birth underneath the apple trees so that the Egyptians would never know that a baby boy was being born. This is because the Egyptians made a decree that any Jewish baby boy that were to be born would be killed. So the Jewish women knew this had to be done in secret. So now we've covered why we have charoset, let's look at what's in charoset. So the recipes for charoset are countless. You know, they've been passed down from generation to generation. They've crossed countries survive wars and everyone's put their own twist on it. Some ingredients that are commonly used in charosa are apples, figs, pomegranates, grapes, walnuts, dates, wine, saffron, even cinnamon. And some people can cut it up like a fruit salad while other families may blend it together so it's more like a paste. Whatever your family custom is regarding the recipe of charosa, I hope that when you eat it on Pesach, you recognize the meaning of why we have it and think about what it represents. I wanted to wish you and your families a very happy Passover.